Alright guys, thanks for tuning into this Diagnostic World video. In this video we're going to be showing you how to do an oil service, an oil filter service and an air filter service in a Mercedes-Benz E-Class. So it's the W212. Uh, now the same applies for the saloon version and also the estate version. So we're going to be showing you how to change the oil, how to change the filters and also once we've done all of that we'll get into the vehicle and use the iCarsoft MB version 2.0 kit to actually reset the counters on the actual dashboard. So um, whenever you, your car needs a service you'll probably get a message on the screen saying that the service is due in so many days or it's due minus so many days if it's gone over. Um, so yeah, so we'll be looking to uh, show you this kit. This kit's available at Diagnostic World. Um, but without me talking too much, let's get straight into the video and let's get on with the oil service first of all. Alright, so first of all you're going to need to either jack up the car at the front end, or in our case we've been able to um, put the car on some uh, ramps, which would probably be safer, but jacks will be fine if that's all you have. Okay, so once you're under the car, you'll need to remove this panel here. Now you've got an 8mm right there, so there's one, two, three, there should be one there, four, and then coming to the back, you've got five and six. So let's get these removed. All right, so I've just realized that you don't necessarily need to take this cover off. This is the one that you really need to take off but it does help if you take this cover off as well. So uh, take that one off, then take that one off again. You're just looking at the, uh, the air mill bolts dotted around. So we're going to do that now. Okay, so with the covers removed, you'll see where the sump is. And this one here is a 13 mil, and this is the oil drain plug. So you get your 13 mil, you pop that on there and you can start slowly on doing that but obviously it's very important at the same time to have your bucket or container ready because this will come out at an angle like that so Okay, so this is the new oil filter, it's a Bosch part. So you can see the filter is almost identical. You've got two rubber O-rings, two smaller ones, and then at the bottom here, we've got a bigger one. So the bigger one is right here. So you take that one off, replace it with that. And then the smaller ones, we have one there and one there. So we'll get these replaced. And just to give you an idea of how much oil 
will come out. This is an 8 litre bucket and you can see it's pretty much full of the rim. So just expect that. Make sure your container is going to be at least 8 litres. Okay, so once the oil is completely drained, you can go ahead and put your sump plug back in. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and put the oil in the car now. We've got this Castrol Edge uh, 030, fully synthetic. 